Here's a plethora of Chevy SSR convertible pickups uh, that were made by Chevrolet from 2003 through 2006. Certainly a specialty vehicle. They started life in 2003 and 4 with the 5.3 liter V8, 300 horsepower, and then were upgraded to the LS2 a six liter engine with 390 horsepower and in later years were available with the uh, Tremec uh, uh, manual transmission and always had the available four uh, speed automatic. And I, I couldn't resist uh, videoing these uh, standing in a row because of the uh, very neat color uh, combinations and you can see how the owners have varied in how much they've kept them stock and how much they've decorated them, changed a few things here and there. And I'm certainly no expert at this uh, with this truck, but uh, you can see how these have become personalized. For example, that uh, that painting under the hood there, and uh, how much the engine bay is decorated. All kinds of variations. So I leave it to you to uh, peruse them. These all came to the show as a result of an invitation to the car club that is associated with the SSR. That top is a power top. And uh, lots of power accessories on this vehicle. It certainly was a, a high line vehicle. Thing is, with the top down, there wasn't an awful lot of room left in the uh, what we would think of as a pickup bed. So you can see that a truck like this certainly wouldn't be used for duties like many pickup trucks are, hauling mulch in from the from the landscaper, that kind of stuff. There you see the available room, and that's with the top up. And this one has a, a spare attached to the back, and I'm not sure what the story is with that. When you take a look uh, at these in detail, you see that one doesn't exactly look like the other one because of the uh, customizing work that's been done. Most of them have the uh, top down, but there is one here that has a top up, so we'll take a, a good look at that one. That's coming up shortly. That one has a dealer um, emblem there in the back. And notice how the roll bars go over each uh, the, each uh, seat. Give a little extra protection.
Notice the painted valve covers on that. These were modeled after Chevy trucks of the late 40s, early 50s. I'll leave a link to describe uh, the SSR in more detail. I don't think they ever sold as many as they expected. And I think one of them, there's one with the top uh, up, so you can see. I think part of it is because they were of limited uh, use as far as the practical uh, hauling things. Certainly, if you wanted to haul anything, you had to have the top up uh, for space. And you see the nice two-tone combination was available. Essentially, the later models used the Corvette engine, just like the uh, GTO from Australia did. <laughs> 